Okay, the new February Witches box. Um, this one, <laughs> the CPSA opened this one. Um, they're just doing their job. Um, it's likely the herbs that were put in here. Um, I just cut their seal just now because they, they cut the rest of it. Um, but yeah, they're just doing their job, so it's fine. Um, so again, this is the February 2020 box. If I can open it. Okay, so salt box. So once again, um, you get a little bit of intro and a list of what's in there. So you get three bags, um, red alia salt, gray salt and ginger salt, Himalayan salt candle lamp, cool, um, tea lights, black obsidian, um, a tarot card, this one from the Radiant Wise Spirit Tarot. I have that deck. Um, a sigil. And then you get your um, usual Book of Shadow pages. So this one's on energy um, You get an energy clearance spell, um, a page on salt, and a page on black obsidian. So that'll be cool to see. Come on, big, hold this down. <laughs> um, so... As usual, the pages are kind of set up like the background, usually for the information is pretty much the same. Um, green witchery, um, new setup for that one. But yeah, this one's the spell, and then you get the info pages. Then you get like the paper shred, <laughs> shreds, so. Okay, this is likely what they were. So, you get ginger sea salt. And it feels like a reasonable bag. So, like you got that zipper enclosure. So, that. The gray sea salt in the same type of packaging. And yeah, it feels like cardboard and it's not like a plastic or um, a really thin paper. And this would be the red alia salt. Sea salt mixed with iron oxide rich volcanic clay in Hawaii. So that's really cool. <laughs> So you get three different types of salts. So if you're, so salt, I've nearly read up on salt, but it's a good like, I think it's like a good purifier or something, good cleanser. Okay. This should be the black obsidian. It looks like it's in its rough form because you've got like, I got little black flecks that have come off, but it's not tumbled or any like tumbled or anything, so it looks raw. So, ooh. This must be the candle holder. Oh wait. There it goes. Okay, I'm not too sure like what like this is because like the next thing would be this is the Himalayan um, candle holder. Yeah, candle lamp. 
so. And then you got the tea lights, a little, well, a little bigger than tea lights. Um, two, two of them? Oh, well, pretty much all of them are banged up in some way, but it's fine. Oh, I got the three of cups again. I think the the last box also had the three of cups in it as well. But it's, it's fine. And there should be a sigil in here somewhere. I'm just wondering if this like dish was a replacement for the sigil. <laughs> um, but Yeah, Dibba did a quick shuffle through. So, like, I'm not seeing the sigil. I have a little dish instead. Um, <laughs> but I'm okay with that anyway. Um, but yeah, it's a nice little trinket ba bowl or whatever. So, the February 2020 salt box, you got that. Me, I got that dish, which I'm assuming instead of the sigil. Black obsidian. Got red alia salt. Gray salt. Gray sea salt. The ginger sea salt. This Himalayan uh, candle lamp, that's what she's called it. Um, three tea lights and a tarot card. So, um, but yeah, I'm, I'm cool with this stack and it's very interesting. And I'll see if I actually use the salts, but, um, the candle holder, I'll definitely give a try. Um, the dish and black obsidian, I'll... I think I have like obsidian in like a small tumbled form, but I don't have it in raw form. So um, I'll likely use the it in the raw form and the dish as a crystal holder. Um, but yeah, February 2020 salt box by the witch's box if you're interested in the box um i do have a link where you can subscribe to the box um down below she has two options um this box and the book subscription box so each month you get like w at least one book i think there's like one or two books that you get um but yeah so link down below for the witch's box subscription and yeah you get you can get really some really cool stuff like this so yeah happy readings